problems or conflicts, AKA drama. It exists everywhere. The gym, your sports team, your kids' sports team, your workplace, your family. We often think it's them and it's not me, or I want no part of this drama, so I'm gonna walk away. But the problem is it never gets resolved and you personally never grow as a person. Problems need to be addressed, resolved, and moved past. But if we never do anything or we never have any self-actualization, guess what? They always come back in a new shape and form. What's up everybody? Coach RJ from www.fitclub.fit, the home of the belly burn. And so today I wanna to talk about how to deal with problems or conflicts, AKA drama. Now, even before Fit Club, I used to work at a different gym. And in this gym, there was tons of drama, tons of gossip, tons of things that I saw. I was only like 22 or 23, and my eyes were so open to how much things were going around me, and I just soaked it all in. Even before that, when I was working at offices, and even in university, there was always some type of conflict between different groups, different people, this love affair, that romance, this person's drama, it's always gonna be there. And so today, I wanna provide you with some factors that are contributing to the drama around you and how you can address them. Now, in the gym environment, there's often a sense of competition, whether it's about physical performance, appearance, or even attention from instructors. This could lead to tension and drama amongst members. And when we look at the solution, we look at people around you as your friends and your family, and that you're all in the same struggle or race together. So what you need to do is support and motivate one another. You gotta grow together. Now when it comes to clicks and social dynamics, like any social setting, people tend to form groups. Sometimes these groups can exclude others, leading to feelings of isolation or jealousy, and so what ends up happening is it can spark some drama. Now the solution is step outside your comfort zone. We've had tons of great friends that have developed since we were kids. Don't stop growing. Find people around you, introduce yourself, step outside the comfort zone and grow your friend zone. What about the infamous gossip? Now gossip can spread quickly in tight knit communities. If some members are prone to talking about others, it can create misunderstandings and obviously create conflicts. So the solution to gossip is that you need to speak directly to the person and instead of talking around the person, go directly to that person so that you can hear from them firsthand because then it's gonna reduce the friction and the drama and you're personally gonna have a better understanding of what's going on versus hearing it from somebody, talking to somebody else, but then directly avoiding the person in the middle. Now, when it comes to personality clashes, different personalities may not always mesh well. In a diverse group, some members might not get along and this is gonna lead to more friction and drama. So the solution, is that we gotta understand that we're not always right. People have all different views and opinions, and this is a good thing because it provides variety and we'll never get bored. If we all did or agreed on the same thing, it would be pretty dull and boring. So look at things from different perspectives. When it comes to communication issues, miscommunication, or lack of clear communication between members can lead to a confusing, and misunderstanding state of mind. And this is gonna to contribute to the drama. So the solution is, the good news is, that you can probably see the person or group daily. So you have multiple opportunities to connect and chat with problems with one another. Or we're all on Facebook, shoot them a DM, go directly to the source, get a call, maybe arrange a coffee. When it comes to expectations and entitlement, now, we all have different expectations regarding class formats or attention from instructors. If some feel that they are entitled to special treatment, it can lead to resentment amongst others. Now, the solution is that us here at Fit Club, we listen to everyone. If it's possible, we will make it happen. If it's something personal, then you have us coaches on Facebook and we always make time to chat. So if you feel that there's something between you and a coach or a front desk member here at Fit Club, then my suggestion is that you send them a message. 
When they get the first opportunity, they're going to reply, and I'm sure it's some kind of misunderstanding. If it's something that's within our control, we'll definitely be able to do that for you, but sometimes we just have to have that communication. When it comes to stress and personal issues, members might bring their personal stress or issues into the studio. And we get it because it's easy for the worlds to overcome. You go from one place to the other, you haven't decompressed from one issue or outside issues and you've brought it into the gym. And so what ends up happening is this personal issue can manifest and it's gonna cause drama when it comes to interaction with others. Now my solution, and this is what I tell my coaches and my front desk staff and everybody here that works here, is that whatever personal things that you're going on, on the outside is that you leave it at the door. You leave your problems outside with the outside world. The gym is a fresh start. So don't let your problems bleed into your happy pace. Now it's a lot, but honestly, I've learned so much from this and I'll take this with me, not just in my business or my fitness life, but also in all the aspects in my personal life. Drama will always exist and it's never gonna change, but how you respond can and will. 100%, we got this. Now, if you're looking for a new home or if you're a member and you really need that extreme push and accountability, maybe you fell off and you're just like, you know what, I'm ready to go. Or even if you're on point and you're just looking for that next level, we got you. Go to www.fitclub.fit, mention the belly burn, and we'll get you started today.